Good morning. Welcome to the Pray Mom with PT. It's a prayer session designed specifically to pray for your children. Let's just lift up the name of God this morning. Exalt the name of Jesus this morning. Father, I enter your court with thanksgiving. I enter, oh God, with praises in my heart this morning. And I give you glory because of who you are. I exalt you, Lord. Thank you, Father, for placing a hedge of protection around my household, around my children and my grandchildren this morning. Thank you for your word in the book of Isaiah chapter 43, verse 2. Bible says, when you pass through the waters, I will be with you. And through the rivers, they shall, be, they, they shall not overflow you. When you walk through the fire, you shall not be burned. Bible says, nor shall the flames scorch you. Come on, give him glory this morning. Exalt the name of God for his edge of protection over you, over your household this morning. Father, I thank you for being with me. Thank you, Father, for your love, oh God. Thank you for your protection, oh God. Thank you for your care, oh God, over my household. Thank you for your word in the book of Psalm 91, verses 9 and 10. Bible says, because you have made the Lord who is my refuge. Bible says, even the most high, your dwelling place, no evil shall befall you, nor shall any plague come near your dwelling. Father, I thank you. No evil, O God, will befall me, will befall any member of my household. I give you praise, O God, for your promises in your word this morning. As I pray for my children and my grandchildren this morning, I submit myself and I yield myself to the Holy Spirit. Let the Spirit of God pray through me this morning in the name of Jesus. Father, we bless you. We give you praise this morning. We exalt you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we give thanks. Amen and amen. We have been praying using the letters A to Z. It's episode 14. This morning, we're going to continue with the letter U. And this morning, by the Spirit of God, I was titled U, Hutterance. This morning, Hutterance talk about a spoken word, a statement. This morning, we're going to lift up our voices and pray for our children and our grandchildren. Cause my children to be confident, oh God. Let them be bold. To be able to open their mouth to declare the greatness of God. In the name of Jesus. Maso kukoliga du taliande. Retabo sotoliga du talianda bo sotoliga. Lift up your voices and commit your children into your hands. God give them utterance. In the name of Jesus. We come against the spirit of spirit speech delay in the lives of our children. We declare utterance today. In the name of Jesus, let their tongues be loosed. In the name of Jesus, Jehovah, give them utterance. In the name of Jesus, lift up your voices with me and begin to pray for your nieces, your nephews, your cousins. You want to pray for them this morning for utterance. In the name of Jesus, Rakabo Sotoliande, losing their tongues, give them boldness. In the name of Jesus to be able to declare the greatness of God in the name of Jesus help them to be confident lose their tongues in the name of Jesus we cancel every agenda of the enemy over the destinies of our children to delay their speech we declare this morning we say be thou loosed in the name of Jesus pray with me this morning reshe teliga boso toliande masaki kaliga lord give my children great pride oh god in the amazing power of your love in the name of jesus let them boast in you alone give them utterance in the name of jesus raso toliga Masha Toriga do Satutalinda, open their mouth wide, O God, and give them utterance. In the name of Jesus, Rakekebo, let the lips of my children and my grandchildren, O God, be filled with your words, O God. Season the words that comes out of the of the mouth of my children. In the name of Jesus, Rakabo Sotoriande, Ephesians chapter 6, verse 19. Bible says, And for me, that utterance may be given to me. 
that I may open my mouth boldly to make known the mystery of the gospel. Come on, pray this morning for her parents, for your children. V, V this morning is vulnerability. Come on, pray that in the name of Jesus, Lord, help my children in the name of Jesus. Masa Toriande Boshitariande. Vulnerability is being exposed to the possibility of being attacked or harmed. Come on, you want to pray that my children will not be exposed, oh God. In the name of Jesus, they will not be vulnerable. And I pray this morning, if there be any area of their lives, oh God, that they are vulnerable, we ask, oh God, for the help of the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus, Rakabo Sotoliande, Rekushaku. Kaliga, help my children, strengthen them in their weaknesses. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Rasha ki kaliande, reke bobo. V is for vulnerability. Rasha ti kaliga, raku kaliga du satu tariande. The circumstances that can make a child be vulnerable. One is poverty. One is single parenting, unemployment, relationship problems, illness, frequent relocation. Family violence. This morning you want to lift up your voices and begin to pray. That Lord, let none of these, oh God, be in my home or in the lives of my children or in my family. In the name of Jesus, attend to my household today. In the name of Jesus, hear our cry, oh God. Eradicate, oh God, poverty in our household. In the name of Jesus, help us to be able to parent our children. In the name of Jesus, let them not be very vulnerable, oh God, as a result of our parenting style. In the name of Jesus, give us wisdom. Even as single parents, as married couples, give us wisdom to be able to raise our children. Pray with me this morning. People will not take the advantage of my children, oh God. In the name of Jesus, people will not take advantage of my grandchildren. In the name of Jesus, pray with me. Rasa kikaliande. Masa toliga du kaliga provide jobs in the name of Jesus for us in our household, oh God. Streams of incomes in the name of Jesus to be able to take care of our children and our grandchildren. Pray with me this morning. Rasha tita liga lekua suta liga rekemo sotoli and debo sotoriga rakaba shukoriande heal our marriages, heal our relationships in the name of Jesus that our children will not be vulnerable. In the name of Jesus, Rakabo Sotori Araba, Rekemo Sotoriande, Rakabu Saku Kaliga, Rekebo Sotoriande, eradicate violence, oh God, from our household. In the name of Jesus, help us, oh God, Rekebo Shikariande, let peace reign in our homes. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Rasa ki kaliande, rekebo shikariga, rasotoriande bo sotoriande. Second Corinthians chapter 12, verses 9 and 10. Bible says, What he said to me, my grace is sufficient for you, and my power is made perfect in your weakness. Come on, pray. That in the name of Jesus, the grace of God is sufficient for my children. The grace of God is sufficient for me as a pray mom. Strengthen me, oh God. In the name of Jesus, Raka Sotoriande, Ratsu Satutaliga, Rekebo Shikariande. Help me, Lord. Help my children, oh God. Let them be raised in a peaceful environment. In the name of Jesus, help me as a pray mom to create a peaceful environment for my children. In the name of Jesus, non hostile environment. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Rasa tu kaliga, lekua su taliande, reke mo shikariande, rake kekebo so toliga buda du sa tu taliande. Second Corinthians chapter 4, verse 7. Bible says, But we have this treasure in jars of clays to show that the surpassing power belongs to God and not to us. Lift up your voices and declare. 
prayer in the name of Jesus. The power belongs to God. Help my children, oh God, not to be vulnerable. In the name of Jesus, give them wisdom. In the name of Jesus, wisdom they need as they grow older in life. In the name of Jesus, give them wisdom that they need to navigate through the journey of life. In the name of Jesus, rasa kikaliande, rekebo shikariga. Let them not be victims of crime. Let them not be victims of rape. In the name of Jesus, Isaiah chapter 41, verse 10. Bible says, fear not. I am with you. Be not dismayed. For I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Come on, lift up your voices and begin to pray. God, eradicate fear in the lives of my children. Replace fear with faith in their lives. In the name of Jesus, be with my children. Strengthen them. In the name of Jesus, uphold them. In the name of Jesus, come on, give him glory this morning. Give him praise. Father, we thank you. We give you glory. We give you praise, O oh God, for utterance concerning our children. Thank you, O oh God, for your strength, O oh God, and your protection over our children and our grandchildren. Thank you for visiting our homes this morning in the name of Jesus. Thank you for restoring love in our families this morning in the name of Jesus. Masha Titaliande, strengthen our relationships with our children, with our spouse with the people that you have placed around us. In the name of Jesus, let our homes be homes of love and harmony. In the name of Jesus, that our children will not be exposed to the attack of the enemy. In the name of Jesus, Father, we give you praise. We exalt you. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Amen and amen. Thank you so much for joining me again this morning. This podcast is brought to you from Prayer and Liberation Ministries. Hi, Pam, for godly counseling and prayers for your relationships and for your children. You can contact me on my email, dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site. I would love to hear from you. Please send me your testimonies and your prayer requests. You can send them to dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site. If you do not receive this podcast directly from me, and you would love to. We have a WhatsApp group for the Praying Mom with PT. Please email me to get an invite invite link to this group. You can also connect with us on our Instagram page with the handle The Praying Mom with PT and our Facebook page The Praying Mom with PT. If this podcast has been a blessing to you, please share with someone. God bless you and bye for now.